My next guest this evening is a pop culture icon and the most famous drag queen in the world. Please welcome back to The Late Show, RuPaul Charles. <laughs> The I gave you the kiss. European double kiss. Yes. Because when I have when I have guests who are that I know from Europe. Yeah. I know to do the double kiss, and I know you from Europe. I know now. you from Europe now. I yes, know, and I'll explain right. why. Because uh, you and I were both uh, at I interviewed the first lady Michelle Obama yes. over at the O2 Arena in London, fifteen thousand people. In England. In England. England. In Angleterre. Yes. And guess who I'm hanging with backstage? It's me <laughs> and RuPaul <laughs> and Malala. Getting glam, viva glam, and 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 Adele. She's on this photo, but Adele yeah, yeah, was there Adele too. Was there, yeah. Who were you most excited to hang out with? Miss Obama. Well, that's true. I guess yes. that's fair. That's fair. Yeah. But that was fun. And now I know you're my friend from England now. No, we had a great time. You're all right, mate. You're all right, babes. You're all right. You're right, pipes. You okay? Yeah. No, okay? that's the, that was my takeaway from the whole England trip. Yes. Was that, you're you know, right. they always, you're, you're right, right, pipes. You're right, pipes. You're right. You're right, pipes. Right. Yeah, that's my thing. Yeah. I say it to everyone. Everyone's sick of me saying it. Yeah. I'm not. Yeah. Right, now, uh, uh, the Met Gala was this week uh, on, on Monday, marking the exhibit, uh, the opening of the exhibit, Camp Notes on Fashion. Uh, RuPaul. <laughs> What is camp? <laughs> what is camp? I will tell you, most people don't understand it because camp, you have to be able to see the facade of life. I'm gonna get philosophical up in here. Do it. You have to be, be able to see the, the, uh, the absurdity of life from outside of yourself. So the idea of drag is camp because we're saying, you know, um, I'm not this body, I'm actually I'm actually God in drag playing humanity, right? So when you are in that place, let the church say amen. amen. When you are in that place, then you can laugh at the absurdity. You know, in 10th grade, I learned, my teacher, Mr. Pinnell said, don't, RuPaul, don't take life too seriously. And that is what camp is about. It's about seeing the absurdity of this crazy life. Have you read the papers lately? <laughs> Well, let me show you. It's camp. Let me show you some really, some really mm. lovely outfits, and you, you tell me whether these things are camp. Because okay. there's been a fair amount of critique of even these beautiful outfits I'm about to show you yeah. ab about whether they actually are camp. Yeah. Okay. Here, uh, here is Celine Dion. There okay. goes. Okay. Well, beautiful outfit. It is beautiful. The, uh, it's. It, it's borderline camp, and I'll tell you why. First of all, it's beautiful. One of my favorites for the whole evening. It looks like Cher Bob Mackie, kind of. You know what? When I saw her on the... I saw... I met her in that moment. I swear to God, Bob Mackie walked by at that very moment, and I said, Bob, is this your dress? He said, no, it's not my dress. But it is borderline camp. It's campy why borderline? because... borderline? Why is it close to camp? Because Celine Dion is wacky crazy, and I love her, and she's campy because she gets the joke. She's in on the joke. That's okay. the answer right there. Did I... How did I do? Now, how about this gentleman right oh, here? Oh, that is pure camp, baby. Right there. That is pure camp. Calm. That's calm. What went, into, what went into this outfit? Is that, is that sequence? Is that beating? It's sequence. It's zebra. Zaldi, who's done my outfits for the past 25 mm -hmm. years, did this outfit. I didn't want to go in drag because I, th I thought it was going to be a sea of drag queens. I really did. And so I thought every, all the guys were going to be dressed up like divine. But not one divine from the John Waters films. Sure. Not one person was dressed up as divine. Wow. Yeah. I don't, people don't really understand camp. It's, it's, uh, it's abstract to most people. Now, you know. what's this on your shoulder here? That looks like a... Is that a sequined right here? It's a sequined zebra. Really? Yes. I was going to ask you it was a flip-flop. No, it's a... Yeah. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah, sure, it is a yeah, zebra. Yeah, it's a zebra. Okay. And, and it, was, it was fun. We had a good time. And actually, I DJ'd uh, at the end of the evening. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm a, I'm nope. a very good DJ. You said, you, said that, uh, you said that drag has always been a political statement. How how has what you do changed in this particular political environment? Well, what we do in drag is more important today than ever before. Can I get an amen up in here? 
It is. Why? Why? Well, well, because, you know, the job of the drag queen, the shaman, the court jester is to help people understand uh, that uh, life is not to be taken seriously. Love is serious. Uh, kindness is serious. But all this other mishigas is not serious. The and way you're supposed to do things. The way you're supposed to do things. Exactly. But um, being mean is not nice and it's not cool. It's not clever. You're all right, babes. And... <laughs> So drag reminds people to not take themselves or life too seriously. Well, this is a this is here's here's politics and drag. This is Kirsten Gillibrand backstage at a uh, a, a drag club uh -huh. in Iowa. Yay! Can you imagine even ten years ago? This being a photograph a politician would would want to have out there. No, I I can't imagine that happening. This is this is really good. I'm mean, gonna tell you say this. You know, gay people pay taxes, drag queens pay taxes. I want a politician who's gonna come to my drag club if I'm paying their salary. You know. Sure. Sure. Well, um, Ru, always yeah. good to see you. Thank you so much You're for right, being here. You're yeah. right, Pipes. Someone like that. <laughs> RuPaul's Drag Race airs Thursday nights on.